Welcome back to the channel guys, of course I want to talk some more about Sparkpoint and we've literally seen this coin, it's been on a tear guys and uh, I did anticipate this and uh, congratulations if you did get in on this, um, I'm actually not too happy at the moment because uh, obviously I got in down here as some of you guys know but I'm always looking for that giant lightsaber okay and i literally when, when i see candles like this i want to be selling the tops okay because anytime you see uh it coming up like that and then you see a giant green candle like that you know you know it's going to come straight back down okay not all the time but most of the time if you're talking about something like xrp back in the 2017 and it just keeps going up well that's uh that's that's not in every coin all right but uh, i would have liked to have been able to at least take half out over here and then wait and see what the rest will do but all hope is not lost because i still believe that this could run a lot more but after seeing this could we see some sideways consolidation could we see a huge pullback it needs to hold up on the moving averages uh, personally i believe we are seeing it bounce at the moment and we hopefully we can see another leg to the upside but don't quote me on that uh, the momentum is literally took off i mean look at that we've got three almost identical bars over here the the, the macd is not putting a, a bearish cross on the one hour the lower time frame so that looks okay obviously we've seen that huge spike on the rsi um i would like to see that continue to the upside um personally um yeah hopefully we can get a bounce there going up to the higher time frame it looks a bit better and it looks like there is still hope for another green candle to the upside and obviously we're in price discovery guys and with the system coin launch coming on friday as well there could be a lot more price action to the upside coming on the rsi we can see it's come up and it's bouncing so there still could be a lot more upside in that as well uh we are in overbought territory but there's still a long way that that could go and uh, it would be nice to see the RSI get up here before we see a bit of a pullback at least then I'll be able to take uh, at least half of my bag out and take a really hefty profit guys I'm making a hefty profit in this coin and um, yeah I'd like to take half out and keep a few million uh, on the table to see where that takes me for the long distance alright so let's just bring that back down spark point is on a tear guys really glad that i found this coin really glad that you guys have found this coin too on the one day uh we can see that huge candle all right this one called the crypto lightsaber by the way guys if you don't know um you know i refer to these big candles as lightsabers and i love to see them crypto lightsabers preferably the green ones and not the red darth vader one but uh yeah there we go uh, so yeah, I mean the volume is looking quite bullish I would like to have seen that a bit higher, but we could still get a build up of volume to the upside It just depends how this wants to perform guys. There's a lot of buying activity coming in There's a lot of people getting excited about this 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 project and um, Yeah, hopefully the big things to come but don't be surprised if we do see a pullback All right at the end of the day. Uh, this is a long-term hold for me I don't intend to take out everything that I have on the table, but it's always good to secure your initial investment. At this point, I've more than, I've made a lot of money on this coin uh, at the moment. Um, I did kind of take some profits over here a little while, um, probably about a week ago. Was it a week? Maybe it was a couple of days. I mean, this has gone so quickly, but um, yeah, I did kind of scale out just a little bit and put that into another coin so these were my original entries around this level 308 all right okay so um yeah as you can see i got him way down here way down here and let's see now when i first started buying spark point i was buying over here but 
got a little bit impatient and I ended up fling let's just go from there. Alright, so we've seen from my entry, we've seen it go up like 700 percent guys. I mean that's huge gains, right? Can't complain with that, can ya? Alright, so even if I if I take out half now, you know, I'm making I'm taking out my initial investment three or you know three and a half times over roughly. Okay? And then I'll leave the rest in, you know, leave half. Uh, and let that that go for the long term maybe you know uh, you never know you know if I see like just something crazy happen you know because when I say long term hold you know in a couple of weeks we could see you know thousands of thousands of percent gains in these low caps all right so it doesn't necessarily have to be a long term hold you got you got to just do with take what the market gives you sometimes and kind of think you know what let me take something there and maybe just leave a little tiny bit on and yeah you can hold that for a couple of years but if you're seeing you know if if, if you put for example you know i don't really like to talk numbers on this channel guys all right but let's just give you an example right for the sake of education all right if you put for example five grand into spark point down here right and then it went up a hundred percent yeah and you took five grand out yeah you've still got five grand in there right for a long-term investment then let's say it goes up after that another 600 percent for example yeah and you take half out right just calculate five thousand yeah and i know we're not all working with those kind of numbers and um you know uh, but let's just let's just uh, it's just for the sake of education an example all right so there's five thousand plus six hundred percent would be thirty thousand thirty five thousand it would bring you to okay so if you if you, if you divide that in two right and you just take take half out right you take seventeen and a half thousand out and you leave seventeen and a half thousand in for the long term I mean this is the way that you can do it guys it's a strategy isn't it yeah I mean you know, it's all good waiting for Spark Point saying, you know, Spark Point a dollar one day, Spark Point two dollars. By the time Spark Point gets to a dollar, I would have took a lot of profits out of that by then. Because at the end of the day, we don't know the future. And I'm not a gambling man, alright? And if I'm seeing significant gains, I'm gonna wanna be scaling out a little bit because and, and, and I could potentially put some of those gains into something that hasn't popped yet. And there's a higher probability that I'm going to make those huge numbers uh, uh, that I'm hoping to make uh, in the long run. Uh, and that's just my philosophy, guys, on it. You know, um, yeah, so, yeah, I'm basically, I would have liked, I, I could scale out a little bit now, but, you know, I do believe it's got a little bit further, even if it was to kind of end, end it right here for now and come with a correction, a little pullback before it continues or goes sideways or come down with a little, you know, little sharp T pattern down and then curve up eventually continuation to the upside because you know really this has still got to go up around 800% to even get to a penny guys I mean there's long term potential it's a lot this is a DeFi project and it's still a very low market cap guys let's see market cap is currently okay so it's up from it's up where was it yesterday it was about six million ish six and a half million uh okay no the last video i did the video i did before that was about six and a half million i did another video after that i think a couple of hours later and then it was 8.8 .8 million now we're up to 15.6 million almost 0.7 million market cap all right huge gains man you know, look at that. Look at that, guys. Coin market cap is really slow, but uh, yeah, look at that. Huge gains, guys, and could still go a lot further. Especially, like I say, it is a DeFi project. I mean, what if this gets to 100 million? That's not off the card for a DeFi project. You know, later on, what if Spark Point gets to a billion? You know, two billion, three billion. You know. Uh, when the crypto, when the entire crypto market cap shifts, and we see trillions of dollars coming in from the global economy, perhaps one day, who knows? You know, leave some on the table and see where that takes you in the future. All right. 
So yeah, guys, Spark Point is pretty exciting right now. Probably my best investment um, at the moment. Uh, I've got a few other holds that I'm holding and they're not doing as well. But uh, right now, I mean, everything that I've got money in is, is in profit, guys. Uh, I'll just put that on the table. Everything's in profit right now. Uh, actually, I may have one that is dwindling off a little bit, okay? But I want to look for some new gems, guys. I mean, it doesn't end here for me. I'm gonna be always going to be searching for the next big thing. So stay tuned on this channel. I think that's the end of the video, guys. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. Let me know in the comments what you think about Spark Point, And I'll see you again in the next one.